Hey everyone, it's me again, Brandon Pierce from OSI Gold Direct, your DIY security product online store. Now, today I have a Google Home Mini and I have a OSI wireless Wi-Fi alarm system with me. Now, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to enable Google to work with the Smart Life app so that you can arm the system using Google Assistant. Now, for security reasons, uh, Google does not allow you to disarm the system and only allows you to arm the system. And the reason for this is um, I don't think they thought it's a good thing to allow you to uh, say your security code out loud or to bypass the security code and open up your house and everything. So I think that's a good reason uh, in itself. So the question you may have now is, is it still worth setting up Google Home with the OSI alarm system knowing that you're only going to use it to arm the system? And the answer is yes, a big fat yes. Two reasons. One is convenience. It's always better if you can skip extra steps uh, if you can and just use voice command rather than having to find your phone, open the app, or just do it from your bed or your couch when you're feeling super lazy and tired. Imagine if you're in bed and you go, oh shoot, forgot the arm system. Then you gotta get up. So why not just use a uh, voice command, right? So that's a perfect reason. The other reason is that you could set it as a task uh, to Google routines to arm the system. So what Google routines is, is if you're not familiar with it, is when you set Google to do a bunch of tasks with one voice command. So for example, what I have set up in my home is before I go to bed every day, I say, Google, good night. And it automatically turns off all the lights, the TV, and then it uh, arms the system. So now it's part of the ecosystem and it's taken all the stress of me uh, having to remember to arm the system. So that is an excellent reason why you'd want to connect your alarm system to Google Home. So if you're ready to do that, I'll show you how to do that in just a few steps right after this. Okay, so at this point, uh, you should have already had your Smart Life account set up. So what we're gonna do is open the Google Home app. Then you're gonna select the plus icon at the top left-hand corner. Then select set up device. Then select works with Google. Here you see a list where you see um, search or you can actually just scroll and click on Smart Life. When you do that, it'll open the Smart Life home screen where you can enter the login credentials. Then select link now. Then you will select authorize to allow Google permission to control devices. And at this point, uh, the OSI alarm system, which is listed in your Smart Life app, will now show up in your Google Home app. So now you should be able to arm the system using Google Assistant. Um, as a quick tip, uh, I would recommend changing the default name, which it shows up as alarm system in the Google Home app. I would change it to something else. Uh, I changed mine to security system. And the reason being is because the word alarm is used in a lot of Google Home commands, such as alarm clock or alarm notifications in Google Assistant. So I would change it just to avoid any confusion. So if you're ready, let's uh, just try this out and see how it works. Okay, so because you're using Google Home only to arm the system, there's only two commands you need to know. The first command is set alarm system to away mode. Again, that's set alarm system to away mode. You're going to be using that when you are leaving the house. That would be the same as pressing the arm button. The second command is set alarm system to home mode. Again, that's set alarm system to home mode. That is what you would be using when you are staying at home and uh, most likely before you go to bed. So that would be the same thing as hitting the stay arm button. Okay, now because I changed the default device name in the Google Home app from alarm system to security system, that has to be reflected in the command. So let's do a test. Google, set security system to away mode. System Saturn, armed. Arming security system. There, so as you notice, it changed orange. That's the color it changes when you're setting the alarm for away mode. Um, that would also be the same thing as manually selecting the arm button here. So let's disarm that. Please input password. System disarmed. There. And let's do the final command. 
Um, we're arming it for when we're at home. So Google, set security system to home mode. System arm. All right, arming security system. There, so as you see, it happened uh, immediately. It turned pink and it says stay armed. That's the color changes when you are arming the system when you're at home. That would also be the same thing as hitting the uh, stay arm button manually. There we go, everything works perfectly and let's call that a wrap. Well, we hope this video helped you out and if it did, please give us a big thumbs up. If you have any questions, just drop us a comment below. And if you wanna see more videos, don't forget to subscribe. All the products that you see on our channel are available with free shipping at osigolddirect.com or amazon.com. Those links are provided in the description below. My name is Brandon Paris and thank you for watching.